Hello again, YouTube. Truth Man here. So, the news comes out that Jada Pickett and Will Smith have been separated, living in different residences since 2016. What I want to talk about on this video is how we all owe Will an apology. Because we all thought that Will was just a simp and he was just... Uh, just stand with her trying to make things work and she done cheated on him so on and so forth but if that's the case I'm a simp too then I'm a simp too because I'm like so when the person when the news broke that Will Smith and Jada Pickett was have been separated for since 2016 uh, I'm like, whoa. I said, so so basically, he either trying to keep up with appearances or he just trying not to lose half of his money. You know, y'all be thinking, well, he look how much money he got. He don't, he probably don't look at it like that. Like some people say the same thing about me. Well, well you know, your relationship failed. You know, that don't mean you can't be cool with somebody. Like, we don't hate each other. We don't despise each other. It's just things happen. You know? That's that's who told me uh, about the Will Smith thing. Well, y'all think when people's relationship go bad, they just... Rah! You know, yeah, you have arguments and stuff. But it don't always be like that, man. Sometimes people do cooperate. To benefit their kids, you know. Maybe that's what will we listen, man. We all owe Will an apology, man. Hey, Will, I'm gonna I'm tell you right now. If you watch me, I apologize. We know all this, man. We making videos about you and stuff, man. And the whole time, Will is just trying not to lose half of his ish, you know the whole time living in separate places and stuff you know that's what Tamara you never know what's going on Tia could be out there Will Smith like it, it be little stuff going on behind the scene like for all we know she probably was like alright you finna leave her I done left him. We don't know. Somebody could have told her that they was going to leave a person and she leave Corey and then they end up not doing it. We don't know the details of all that, man. It'd be all kind of stuff going on behind the scenes in these relationships and stuff like that. But that just... And I'll tell you something else. It also... It's still, Jada still look like a monster, but it also kind of changes the way you look at her. Here's what I mean by that, because some of the things she did, they not together. Like when you think about it, man, if my thing would be this, well, just don't have them up in my house that I got to pay for or anything like that. And keep them away from my kids. What y'all do, hey, that's y'all. And that's how I look at it. As long as he don't try to play daddy, nobody needs you to do that. And he stay out of my uh, uh, residence. Like if I had to pay for it. Now nah, if I ain't have to pay for it, hey man, do you. Do whatever you like. But if I'm paying alimony and paying rent and stuff, hey, man, you ain't allowed over here, man. Y'all can come anywhere. All right, man. All right. See, a lot of this white stuff be escalating. Like stuff like that. That also brings it to light him slapping Chris Rock like Will was just being a bully. Okay, if you know you ain't even with her, why would you slap Chris Rock? Somebody, and then he walked off like a pimp. That's why he's, 
Hey, Marvin, Marlon Wayans, that was funny, man. He said, uh, Tupac got in Will Smith. Oh, man, that was stupid. So, that changed how we look at that. Now Will's looking like a bully, like hitting Chris Rock like that. Now, it's a rumor also that Chris Rock tried to get with her while they were separated. But, anyway it go, that slap, he shouldn't have even did that, man. But now, like I said, we got to look at it in a different light now because they ain't even been together. We got to look at all the stuff. Wait, what is that in... It be looking like there's something on my face. We got to look at it all in a different light now. Now, Jada, Jada Pickett, she's still Jezebel, but she ain't looking like the Jezebel she was looking like before because they weren't even together. You know, he should have just... If he couldn't handle, like, what she was doing and who she was doing, he should have just went on but Will Smith is trying not to lose his money. That's what that is now. Like, now we get it. Because I used to always say, it's something that just not matching up with this. And now we see what it is. They ain't even been together, y'all. So, we all need to say, like, everybody that made videos about Will need to say, hey, Will, hey, man, we apologize, man, because we, we realize... You worth how much? 320 million? 160 million is a lot of money to give up to somebody that ain't even with you like that. And I know because I ain't nowhere near Will, but you know, hey, I, hey, I ain't gonna get into my situation, but I calculated how much I would have to pay. It ain't looking pretty. The hope would be, you know, just no contest stuff like that. You know, just carry on like we've been carrying on. Like, ain't no animosity. At least not on my end. But, anyway, I wanted to talk about that. Thanks for watching. Keep tuning in for more videos.